Jumping Sumo is very easy to pilot. To go forward or backward, just slide your thumb on the left joystick. Forward and backward. To control the direction of Jumping Sumo, hold the left joystick with your thumb and tilt your smartphone or tablet to the left and to the right. Depending on the angle at which you tilt your device, you can either turn very fast or turn at very precise angles. To make a quarter turn, swipe with your finger from left to right, or swipe your finger up and down to make a U-turn. Now we're ready to go. To make upward jumps, simply press the high jump button. And it jumps. Huh. To make forward jumps, press the long jump button. So cool. Jumping Sumo has adjustable wheels for two piloting experiences. Open wheel mode, which gives Jumping Sumo greater stability and high speed, or retracted wheel mode, which enhances the agility and maneuverability through narrow areas. By pressing this button once, the Jumping Sumo turns back. By holding this button, your robot switches to auto balance mode, which allows you to drive on uneven surfaces, such as carpets or beds, like this. The kick era mode allows Jumping Sumo to kick objects and obstacles. To kick objects, set the Jumping Sumo backwards in front of the object and pre-charge the long jump like this. Then, tap again the long jump icon to shoot. Several fun acrobatic animations are pre-recorded in the Jumping Sumo. To activate them, go to the animation menu and make your selection. Jumping Sumo will run automatically. Some of the acrobatic animations include spin, spin jump, in the settings menu, you can also modify neutral rotation speed. For example, if you want to go straight into a narrow corridor, put the neutral rotation speed to 100%. Modify max speed. Change the name of your drone for easy recognition. Change the sound of animations. Jumping Sumo emits sounds depending on the animation chosen. You can customize these sounds in the settings.